In your health news, the Ector County Health Department hosted a massive back to school clinic to provide vaccines for students for the upcoming school year. CBS 7's Armando Gomez spoke with the director of the Ector County Health Department today about that clinic. Armando? That's right, Jay and Mary Kate. For the first time in two years, the vaccine clinic provides vaccines and other services for patients. The state of Texas requires that incoming pre K, kindergarten, and seventh grade students have pediatric vaccines. The county is also offering COVID vaccines and physicals for student athletes. We'll have um, Texas Tech physicians here tomorrow doing physicals. Those that are going into seventh grade will need to get sports physicals, and we will have Texas Tech here um, doing those. And um, we also are offering the COVID vaccine. Vendors and small business formed a partnership with the health department to provide service for patients. Today's turnout at the clinic attracted almost 200 people. Get children vaccinated before they go back to school um, with the required vaccines that the state wants them to have, depending on their ages. Uh, we have done this for the last three years. Um, and this is the second year that we've had partners and vendors that we're very appreciative to come out and um, provide services and education for our patients. Brandy Garcia decided to do this clinic to help as many patients as possible get vaccinated and help the vendors at the same time. It felt like it would it would draw in more people. Uh -huh. um, it would also uh, allow our partners to come in and, and provide services and education to the community. There will be another vaccine clinic tomorrow and Saturday morning. Midland ISD is also going to have a back to school clinic on August 12, but spaces are limited. For CBS 7 First Alert News, I'm Armando Gomez.